Hi everybody, how are you? In this video, I will explain how I created a chat um, that can show AI generated images from DALI. Uh, in my previous video, I explained how um, I could create a chat uh, able to communicate with ChatGPT. Uh, so we will reuse this chat, uh, but this time for image generation. Uh, so let's begin with a small demo. I have here the application running on the Samsung device, so we will send a sentence to the system, we call it a prompt. So you have to be very precise here and maybe a little bit creative because the more detailed the prompt is, the more accurate will be the final result. So let's uh, send something very uh, random, like for example, uh, a psychedelic vibrant photograph of a hairless dog astronaut. Let's see. So we wait a few seconds. <laughs> I love I love it. it it's awesome. I love hairless dogs and uh, and this picture is, is awesome. So it's it's working fine, uh, and uh, I will now explain in in a nutshell how it works. Um, I will not again in this video. I will not dive into details because um, there is a, a whole article explaining everything. Uh, you can you can download the source code, the Unity package. So I invite you read uh, to read the article for more details. Okay, so let's see the architecture. First of all, the Unity client app logs to the system thanks to Cognito, which is the authentication service of AWS. Once logged, the application can post uh, the prompt or the message sent uh, by the user to an endpoint we created thanks to API Gateway. API Gateway will trigger a Lambda function. In this Lambda function, we call the OpenAI API, but not for ChatGPT, this time for DALI. So we call the image generation endpoint of, uh, of OpenAI. And then uh, an image will be generated and stored in a bucket. Um, in the Lambda function, we return the URL of this image and after that, the client app is able to get the image, read the image, and show it on screen. I will briefly show you the Lambda function. So this is a function in Python. Uh, it's very straightforward. We just extract the message sent by the user, and we call the image creation endpoint of OpenAI with this message. And finally, we return the image URL. It's very, very simple. And uh, I invite you to read the documentation, the, 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 the OpenAI documentation. It's very well explained. I will now show you uh, briefly the, the Unity application. So this is the same uh, application we used the last time uh, to communicate with ChatGPT. But this time we replace the text uh, by an image. So when the image is loaded from the bucket, we will just uh, show it on screen. Uh, so this is basically how it's wor it works. Uh, thank you for watching the video. Um, I really, really hope you liked it. And if you have any question, any doubts, uh, you want to tell me something, uh, please don't hesitate and uh, reach me out on my social network or Medium or LinkedIn. Bye.